I've got to explain. I've never trained with Dan before. I've always wanted to, but I'm slightly nervous. You have actually once. I'm trained, yeah, once. Yeah, but not one on one. And that was hard. Yeah. Just to be <laughs> that different, that'll be hard. Yeah. Different hard. So Dan's my PT, which yeah. is why I look so good. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and now I need to figure out. I take full pain credit. <laughs> full credit. <laughs> Going to the beach. Yeah. So we're doing a picnic at the beach today and we forgot all of the stuff for the picnic, so We'll go stop off at the servo and pick up <laughs> whatever they've got. Absolutely. Ice cream. So these are our healthiest options here. We've got sandwiches, some pistachios, and these are not for me. Just water there for a little bit. I've got to try and keep an eye out because where I want to take you is a waterfall that me and Jonathan came to here before. Mm. But unless you know it's there, you'll never see it. I'm struggling to try and remember what it looked like. Oh no! <laughs> so, <laughs> hopefully I can remember and we can find this spot. We're trying out this thing today. I don't know if it's any good or not. Cause look what I just did. If this thing was waterproof, it would be amazing. Ooh. Hey babe, can you hear the water? Yeah. And the people? Yeah. We just had to climb down this. Look at the scale of this thing. It's yeah. no joke. We're done. All right. We've just got to West Head Lookout, which is the way you get into the beach that I wanted to show Pia. But we've just realized it's 800 steps down <laughs> to the beach, which means it's going to be 800 steps up back to the car. In over 40 degrees. And we brought this much water. That's all that's left in our bottle. We're literally on like rations with water, having to take tiny little sips. The guy that just let us in was like, I don't think you should do that walk if that's your drink. So we had a nice picnic under the waterfall. That was lunch. And now we're trying to find a nice little location to take some photos. But look at this view. had lunch at the waterfall then we went to this amazing lookout but now we're in the car again and we're driving to Palm Beach to go spend the afternoon there and get a couple of nice photos we've arrived we're at the beach 
Finally! <laughs> it's still so warm too. Oh man, it's 4 p.m., 5 p.m. and yeah. it's 34 degrees still. It's awesome. It's okay. gonna be a really nice afternoon. If anyone's wondering. <laughs> this is how much effort we put into our B-roll. <laughs> it's a little sneak peek on how we get this shot. <laughs> I can't even thought. If I had a dream house location, this would be it. Yeah, it's kind of like, you know the house in Twilight? Mm. How there's like forest all around and it kind of goes up like a cliff edge type thing. Except when you get to the bottom of the mountain, there's like a beautiful beach. Yeah, the only, the only bummer is with this area, it's about 30 to 40 minutes out of town like when I say town I mean Sydney city yeah and all of our work all of our friends and pretty much everywhere we go is in the city so I think when you live out in these sort of areas you're quite secluded yeah. and I'm not quite ready to do that whole settle down and have kids out in the countryside <laughs> thing yet countryside this is the countryside right I don't know well it's definitely not the city we live right in the middle of the city so like for us we don't even have to walk anywhere to go to like a grocery store or anything like it's literally all downstairs yeah so. we live above a grocery I make a lot of stuff you gotta start giving me a little bit of credit the only thing we get from a grocer's every week is 36 bottles of sparkling water <laughs> and I get baked beans for my baked beans on toast every morning I cook you're such a liar I I have this concept for a cooking show called Double Dessert Day where basically anyone out there that is a girl or a boy who has a girl or a boyfriend, you guys can watch our show on a Sunday, I think we'll do our Sundays, and I will cook a dessert and Pia will cook a dessert, but ultimately you get two desserts because it's Double Dessert Day. Nice. That is the best concept for a show. So the whole show will just be desserts, two desserts every show? Yeah.